Welcome to the Auto Electronics Lab, located at School of Physical and Mathematical Sciences, Nanyang Technological University, Singapore. It's my great pleasure to briefly introduce the research in my group and the recent work published on advanced materials. The main theme in my research group lies in the investigation of light matter interaction. In our recent paper appears on advanced materials, we have reported a simple yet effective method to fabricate truly three-dimensional confined micro resonators with tulipe size and flexible position. We believe this structure may become an excellent platform for both fundamental research and optoelectronic devices. Next, my student Dr. Chen Rui and Mr. Tao Fan Zong will present some more details about this work. In order to form a three-dimensional confined microresonator, first of all we need to deposit a suitable black mirror on top of the subject. The material from the microresonator is dyed up epoxy resin with very high viscous. With a fiber rod as a tool and a polymer layer serve as a hydrophobic layer. We are able to fabricate the microresonator with a tunable size and position. The structure was frozen kneeled at 80 degrees Celsius for one hour. After that, solid state emission physical microstructures can be found located on top of the substrate with tunable size range around 5 to 120 micrometers. The optical pumping of the microstructure was carried out using a pulse screen laser. The emission from the microstructures can be collected from the top or from the edge by spectrometer. By increasing the pumping density, you can see very clear the process from spontaneous emission to the stigmatic emission. After analyzing, the laying mechanism was ascribed to the waste spring gallery mode. The simulation implies that the three-dimensional confined microcavity is defined by the hemisphere free microcavity and the black mirror underneath. For more information, please refer to the paper.